Today's topic is bloating. Bloating is a sensation of abdominal fullness. This commonly occurs as a result of a buildup of gas somewhere in the gastrointestinal tract, may be associated with gastrointestinal disorders or organic diseases. About 16 to 30 percent of people report that they regularly experience bloating, so it is very common. Bloating can cause discomfort and sometimes pain and have a negative impact on the quality of life for some individuals. Bloating and distension are not the same. Bloating can be described as the feeling that there is an inflated balloon in the abdomen. Distension refers to a visible increase in measured abdominal size. Abdominal bloating and distension can occur together, but that may not always be the case. Studies in people reporting bloating have shown that only half also have abdominal distension. The main reason to differentiate between bloating and distension is that there may be different underlying causes, so different treatments may be needed. Causes. There are many causes of bloating. They include irritable bowel syndrome, swallowing air when eating too fast or drinking fizzy drinks, constipation, food intolerance, usually to milk, as in lactose intolerance, fructose intolerance, wheat, and gluten. Hormones, especially before a period or during menopause. Food allergy. Overeating. Celiac disease. Certain medications, such as phentermine. Massive infestation with intestinal parasites. Gas-producing foods, including legumes like beans and lentils polycystic ovary syndrome, and ovarian cyst, diverticulosis, dehydration, intra-abdominal tumors, such as those from cancers of the ovary, liver, stomach, and uterus, cardiopulmonary resuscitation, gastroparesis, gastroesophageal reflux disease, symptoms, a sensation that the abdomen is full, sharp pain that may occur anywhere in the body and change locations rapidly. A doctor should be consulted if bloating is accompanied by diarrhea, bloody stools, chest discomfort, loss of appetite or feeling too full quickly, persistent or severe abdominal pain, unintended weight loss, changes in the color of stool or frequency of stools. These signs could signal an underlying digestive condition. Diagnosis and Treatment The doctor will start by asking you questions about your condition, including symptoms, duration of the bloating, current medications, and review your medical history. The doctor then carries out a physical exam that includes palpating your stomach for masses or swelling, tapping your tummy to identify any fluid present, and listen to bowel sounds to detect any obstruction. The doctor may suggest certain diet trials to determine if there is a particular food that is triggering your bloating. To help rule out lactose, fructose, or sucrose intolerances, a breath test may be recommended. Investigations are needed in some patients, especially if serious symptoms are present. Imaging studies such as ultrasound, CT scan, endoscopy may be used. Treatment. Treatment depends on the underlying cause. Bloating will usually resolve itself by making certain lifestyle and dietary changes. This may include Avoiding carbonated beverages Eating small, frequent meals at a reasonable pace Avoid chewing gum as this predisposes to air swallowing Gas-producing foods such as beans and lentils should be avoided Regular exercises Taking a walk after each meal Bloating caused by constipation can be treated by eating more high-fiber foods, exercising regularly, and increasing fluid intake. Food enzymes can be taken before food, as if consumed or added to food that causes gas and bloating. Another form of treatment is antacids. Antacids enable gas buildup to be belched away more easily, reducing the amount of bloating that develops. Methicone, an oral anti-foaming agent that helps the body to expel gas more quickly, can also be used. If any medical condition is causing bloating, 
we should first treat the underlying cause. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.